What up world, it's your boy Herc Soul. And today I wanna to talk about Kyber Crystals, specifically the difference between Canon Kyber Crystals and Legends Kyber Crystals. So to start this video off, I, I wanna say, there aren't too many things that Canon does better than Legends. There aren't really anything that Canon does better than Legends. But I, I really think when it comes to, to the concept of Kyber Crystals, I think Canon, Canon's version is better. And I'm going to give you a list of reasons why. So um, remember to uh, like, subscribe, and you know, leave a comment uh, and tell me what you think about the video. Okay, so to start us off, in Legends, uh, when a, a Jedi gets to that point where he's going to build his lightsaber, what he does is he, he goes on a journey into whatever cave, because it's, it's, it's numerous caves, not just on Ilum, but he, he goes on a journey and he, he enters the cave and... Uh, the crystals already have a color, you know, green, blue are the main colors, and you have yellow, purple, orange, or whatever, it's, it's, a, it's a rainbow of colors, and a, a Jedi, you know, he chooses his lightsaber, uh, he chooses his kyber crystal, excuse me, and he, he puts it in his lightsaber, and that's the color, and, you know, this is cool, you know, um, having all these colors, you know, it gives you a variety, and um, I think that's a problem you know um, at this point uh, the kyber crystal and the lightsaber seems more like an accessory than an apple actual weapon and um I blame a nice uh, I blame the old republic for that you know they introduced the concept of all these different colors I feel like less is more and in this case when you have all these colors it really diminishes the meaning of specific colors whereas in canon your crystal is clear you can like you you can't even like you can't even see crystals unless the crystal is chosen you. And, and once you find your crystal your specific crystal embed your aura in that crystal and it picks a color and i think that's so dope because it, it makes the kyber crystal seem more personal like it makes it seem like this is actually your weapon and not just some pretty accessory that you know you can change colors to anytime. Canon's version of Kyber Crystal makes it seem like it's an extension of you. Like, okay, in Legends, you know, you defeat someone is defeated and you get their Kyber Crystal and you put it in yours. Well, you know, it, it, it was their Kyber Crystal originally, but you know, it's yours now. But in Canon, it's like you use someone else's kyber crystal it's it's their kyber crystal their force their spirit is in that crystal so no matter who uses it that's their crystals and I, I and i really like that i really like that idea i really like that they really made it personal and we let's look at the um the white lightsabers um in legends uh again you can just find the white crystals but in canon, the, the white hue, the, the white crystals actually come from purifying a kyber crystal that was bled, which leads me to the Sith side. Uh, in, in, in canon, you get, your, you get the red uh, kyber crystal from bleeding it. And bleeding it is pretty much putting all your hate, pain, and anger into a crystal to the point where it bleeds. Because now, in canon, kyber crystals are living, they're, they're, they're semi-sentient, I guess. And ideas like this gives the force more meaning. Um, it, it really makes you want to dig deep into the force. And I really like that, uh, what canon's doing with the force. They're, they're really expanding it, you know. Uh, they're playing with ideas like, you know, time travel and stuff. And don't get me wrong, I don't want to see people traveling through time but the fact that it's possible through the force really you know it really makes you wonder what else they can do with the force so I, I like the fact that the crystals are now uh, living um, but going back to the Sith um, in Legends the, uh, you get your, your red crystals they're a uh, synthetic they're they're made and I, and I really did like that I really did like the fact that you know you, you can you can make your kyber crystals and um but the thing is the kyber crystals were indeed the red ones were indeed 
powerful, more powerful than regular, but they also had drawbacks like they'll deactivate in the middle of battle and stuff like that. And and, and I really like that. And, you know, it kind of gives gave it that mad scientist feel, and I really like that. But the fact the, the bleeding. It just sounds sinister. It sounds dark. It, it really sounds Sith, and I, and I love that. You know, it's just like when you when, when you see Vader bleed his crystal, it really makes it feel dark. It really makes it seem like he fell to the dark side, which we already knew that, but you can see it. His crystal can feel it. Now, don't get me wrong. If if it was up to me, I'd still keep the concept of synthetic crystals, but I also keep the bleeding the crystal as well and i'll just make it that you know bleeding the crystal makes the crystal turn red and synthetic crystals are something like a dark orange or a deep orange something you know still kind of give it that sith feel to it but i really like the concept of bleeding and i think bleeding gives a better story than the synthetic crystals and also um one thing in legends is um you know the sith they only use lightsabers because um it, it was to mock the Jedi and you know that's uh, I never really liked that it, it, it sounded real cartoon like mm -hmm, we only do this to mock the Jedi uh, you know it sounded it sounded cheesy uh, like what Jedi would feel mocked that a Sith used a lightsaber you know he has bigger problems he, there's a Sith with a lightsaber he I'm pretty sure he doesn't care that the Sith are trying to mock him but it also gets me to thinking, um, when you when you get a, a Jedi with a certain color, it really makes me wonder like what 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 is what is it with their energy, like what is it with their specific, you know, relationship with the force that makes a specific color. Like with Mace Windu, we we can guess that his his color, his type of crystal came out purple because he he dances with the dark side and the light, so you get the blue and you get the red and it makes purple. Well, well okay, so let's 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 assume that blue and green still means the same thing as it did in Legends. Blue means um, you lean more towards lightsaber uh, combat, you, you lean more towards harnessing your skills with lightsaber, and green means you lean more so towards uh, harnessing your skills with the force. So let's let's stay there. So what does that mean for someone like Terra Sanube, whose lightsaber is a light blue? What does that say about his energy? Or someone like Ahsoka Tano, whose first lightsaber was pure green, but her second lightsaber is a yellowish green. So does that mean that she's starting to stray away from, I guess, the role of quote unquote consular, and now she's leaning more towards the role of sentinel? You know, it, it just it, it creates these questions that I really want to find answers to, and I, and I really enjoy the I really enjoy the fact that you know before you know you you pick a green crystal or a blue crystal or a yellow crystal or whatever, and you know and, and it has its meaning, but that's the meaning you picked, but now the meaning picks you, and I and I really like that. You know what I'm saying? I, it seems more true. But that's just my opinion, you know, and we all about opinions over here. So tell me what y'all think, you know, do y'all like Canon's new uh, concept of Kyber Christmas? Or do y'all prefer Legends? You know, I know most people prefer Legends, you know, a lot of people don't get Canon a chance. But, you know, I, I love Legends, but I'm finding some real enjoyment in Canon. So, um, you know, tell, tell me what y'all think, you know, remember to um, subscribe, uh, leave a like, please leave a like. Uh, comment, you know, whether you like it or dislike it, you know, just leave a comment. And, you know, this your boy Hurt Sofa. Signing out. Peace.